Hello everybody, Shift3 again, and today I'll be playing Guild of Ascension. The game is a turn-based combat game, but uh, when your turn comes, and when the enemy turn comes, uh, it's time-based. So uh, it's not like you press attack and it attacks, you actually play your turn for 5 or 10 seconds or however much it is, and uh, then the enemy turns arrive. So it's turn-based, but it's also real-time. I guess that's the unique aspect of it. So the game just launched, so I decided to, you know, play a bit and see how this will go. Uh, let's go with a new game just to get the tutorial going. I mean, uh, yeah, I, I would like to go through. Yeah, let's start so the new game and uh, go through the story, the tutorial and pretty much everything. Welcome. Let us guess. You are here to attempt ascension, aren't you? Nod. Hmm. We have seen others like you. They did not make it far. We shall see. First things first, I grab a weapon from the rack. We cannot let you in the tower empty-handed. The tower being the roguelike element. Choose. Well, this will be the weapon so you will carry in the tower, at least for your first attempt. Ah, by the way, it's a roguelite. Uh, forgot to say that in the beginning. So, sword and shield. Sword and shield are well balanced and easy to learn. They allow you to attack and push enemies close. Uh, push back close enemies, maybe. Bow. Bow attack distance, perfect to stay far from your enemies for trigger explosion safety. Yes, most likely. Hammer. Hammers are slow and mighty. You will deal a massive amount of damage to a single target if you perfect your timing during your turn. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's go with uh, Tank and Ranger. That's how I'm gonna play this. It goes for you as well. Grab a weapon, lest you want to be left behind. Choose whatever feels good. You will get to try other weapons, better weapons as you progress in the tower and nod. Okay, we go with the bow on him. Oh, I could do double bow. Should have gone for double bow. Before we start, we want to offer you a precious item. It's our famous Toweropedia. It includes all the knowledge you may need about the tower and its mechanics. We also include a chapter on how to use your weapons. Have a look at if you wonder what you can do. Okay, uh, let's continue. I mean, that was just how to open the menu. Okay, and here is the grid, what it looks like. Uh, yeah, I don't like the camera zoomed in that much. Before we let you enter the tower, you must see that you are ready. That is why we have prepared the test for you. Nothing too hard, don't worry. One last thing before you start. We need you to sign this waiver, you know, just in case. Um, yeah, by the way, let's zoom out. Let's move around. As you see, I'm moving in real time. I can, like, do half steps and I can also move around. It's not like five steps and your turn ends. So let's just move around. Then the next one I'm gonna learn is the camera. I mean here I can change the camera, I can make it even a chess camera I guess. Nobody, I don't think anybody plays like this. Maybe if you want to see what's happening. Uh, cold click to combo, so those are normal attacks, classic classic stuff. Uh, this is my charge attack, which uh, pushes enemies back, although it's not really, really shown here. I'm just spamming this to get through the tutorial. Escape to open the pause menu and go to the weapon category. So we go here in Tauropedia and go into weapon types as requested and here are the weapons and you can see the four basic moves and the four advanced skills. So these are completely different between each weapon but these are about the same the bottom two. So we have deal 15 damage and gain four skill points. Skill points are for skills to use skills you know and abilities or charge is deal 10 to 20 or 30 percent of your attack stat. Attack is a stat when it's like brackets it means stat. Um, and push, it's a keyword, I mean, brackets means it's a keyword. Push enemies 1, 2, 3 cells away, gain 10, 25, 50 skill points. Yeah, I mean, that's gives you, that gives you more skill points on this one at least. And then our abilities is dash, dash for sure, the reason to deal damage, 20% of our damage. Spin slash, slash, deal 80% attack on 3 cells, regen 50% dodge points, and holy wrath deal 150 attack on 5 cells. We will, we, I will show them all. And then this, uh, these are the archer skills. I, I, you know what? I will go through them while I'm uh, playing too. I don't need to read everything up. Okay, so uh, yeah, let's let's start using skills. First skill, hit the dummy thin skill here. The let's start with the normal slash here. Three, these three, uh, I guess fields got hit. Uh, select skill points when performing combo. Fill the skill point gauge to max. So as you see, if I attack normally, this is how much I get. But if I do the charge attack, it does a bit more. And if I fully charge it. Boom, instantly a bunch. Now let's continue. Now the the bar is fully fully filled. I hit the damage within skill. Let's go with my ultimate skill here. This is the cross attack. It even zooms in. Boom, that does 150% of my normal damage. Let's get our skill points back. As you can see, this is like the fastest way to pick up skill points. 
And then this skill would be instantly refilling this uh, blue bar, which I'm going to explain in a bit what it is. And then, then this first skill, let me showcase it from afar, is charge. And it's hitting a bunch of times. So if an enemy is next to you, hit him again and again and again. Let's go back. And I guess we're going to change character here. Yeah, we're going to change characters here. Now we're with the uh, archer. Uh, hold attacks. A, a bit faster on the attack speed. And also, man, again, is a lot faster too. Right click for a charge shot. Boom. Not sure if it's a good idea to charge shot. It says three times. Here might as well go for three charge shots. That will tell me to go with the skills. So first skill is a piercing shot. Second skill is an explosive shot. So it's like a cross here. Depending on how the enemies are, you know, in the same place. Third skill is a blink. It's supposed to be a blink, but it looks like this. What happens is while you move around, the time does not move. You will understand time moving in a bit. And then uh, my last ability here on the archer is some tracking shots. Let me show them from here. It's it's better to showcase them like that. They just the archer just shows it on its own where the enemies are and just starts shooting, starts blasting. And over here we get our dodge points. So what is happening in this game is it's as all it's almost as if it's a barrier. So as long as you have blue, when you get hit, you first lose the blue and then you lose your normal life. Uh, good enough that will do now let us set up the room for the next test so as you understand dodge is very important always keep your dodge maxed out if you don't have anything better to do once you enter the tower your goddess will cha challenge you by placing magical constructs in your way you will not be able to rest between rooms but a good meal should give you back some of your energy your challenge is to push as far in the tower as possible okay if you are defeated at any time the goddess will simply send you back outside healing your wounds and rewarding you based on your achievements within the tower that's good we managed to recreate a small encounter. That's a, uh, by the way, there is meta progression in this game. We managed to recreate a small encounter based on the tower's rules right here. So do not be afraid and give it your best. So yeah, fights within the tower are turn-based. Only the active character can start actions at the beginning of your turn. You have a three seconds to to think about it, and then you, if you wait too long, your turn begins. And if you press anything, your turn also begins. Uh, enemies, the enemies UI will display their next action here at the bottom. Um, I mean, I think you have to learn what is what. This, this provides a useful hint for how to handle the situation and make sure to learn all the moves each enemy can perform. So, is it written somewhere what it's gonna do? No, it's just an axe. I guess axe means that he's gonna attack. And that was a three hits, it's dead. That This is one turn, by the way. This was only his turn and he, I guess, you can like wiggle, but the moment you try to move it instantly thinks it's... Uh, you have started playing, so the time starts going down. Enemy turn. Not bad. It feels like I have either 3 or 5 seconds. Now let us add some challenge. Different enemies will use different attacks. Try to memorize and dodge them. I don't think uh, they're gonna do anything. You can hold control to zoom out using the tactics view and see more info of the enemies. Oh, that's good. You can see their turn order, attack and defense value, as well as their threat zone. You can also hold F to speed up the enemy animation and process to the next turn faster. Ah, yeah, I mean, if I don't want to see everything. The time doesn't even stop when you're here. 20 life, 50 life, 20 life, 5 attack, 10 attack, everybody's attacking, I think. Uh, get, I guess let's get rid of this guy. Whoops. Get rid of this guy and maybe use my skill here. No. Oh, I can change my skill direction on the fly. I did not know that was a thing. Attack, 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 attack. And let's go with the skill in the end. And he's dead. Very nice. Uh, you seem ready now. We will wait for you at the village. That is where you can access the tower. Okay, welcome to our village. How do you like it? We tried to make it warm and cozy. The tower is just between behind us. You will be ready to go in a second. Normally, we would introduce you to all the merchants. But with no ascenders in a while, they had to go explore towers themselves. They surely got lost. While you're inside, if you could look for them, that would be... But you said that if I die in the tower, then the goddess brings me back. Does that not apply to the merchants? Um, either way, let's, uh, let's start going into the forest. And uh, by the way, I'm playing right now... I think in the beta version so this footage you're seeing is not the final footage uh, because uh, I, I pretty much record this one day earlier because I got a key from the devs so uh, if there are gonna be any differences we will you will see them from tomorrow's video on onwards as I will then start playing the launch version you who enters the forest be warned the the way is most perilous search under each vine defeat every foe and only then may the path lead you up May the forest be with you, my children. Okay. Campfire. The campfire is your central hub and the only place you can always visit within the tower. 
Okay, from here, from there, you can explore the floor, leaving the tower, use items in your kit, or spend XP to level up. Come hell, spending XP to level up, so XP doesn't just level you up, you have to spend it, okay? Come here as often as you think is necessary. Uh, when you level up, you must choose what kind of upgrade you prefer. The pre-build options will automatic automatically increase the corresponding stats. You can choose to increase different stats between your two characters. Okay. Uh, what is the plus symbol? Plus symbol means... Mm, what does the plus symbol mean? I don't see anything explaining what the plus symbol means. Maybe it's the... Yeah, whatever it is, doesn't really matter. I mean, those three are the same, so might as well start going anywhere. Let's go. No reason to think about it too much. Okay, this is the fight. I can even choose the turn order. That's nice, I guess. Um, yeah, I mean, let's confirm. Uh, let's think about this. I should always do this, by the way. 15 defense. This I, I can kill this guy easily, and then I can go over here and try... When you defeat enemies, you will gain experience points or XP. The total of each character's XP is displayed near the next to the level. Okay, got it. These crystals are XP. Use XP at the God statue to level up and increase your power. Got it, got it. And I did. I tried to do the slash at the end, but she didn't have enough mana. By the way, the camera is a bit too zoomed in. Okay, and we found loot. I have to creep it pressed. Privilege. Privileges grant bonuses to the owner. Some may even break the tower's rules. Nice, that's the part we love. When you receive a privilege, you must decide which of your characters will be benefiting from it. Okay, got it. So it's like relics, but uh, it's privileges. It's like relics for each character. Characters can only hold a set number of privileges at a time shown by the slots. Okay, there are slots too. Good to know. Dodge by four. Killing enemy grants you in temporary strength ups. That's fact. After every third attack, your partner will perform basic attack in front of them. Let's go with this on the go with this on the archer, so that the archer, uh, because he has a good attack speed, random event. Let's start with event. Uh, let's start with event. I guess this symbol means ex this one, and uh, this symbol, the plus. I don't know what the plus means. Maybe the plus is the the item. Okay, you are invited to play dice, gamble. Gambler. Oh, it's it's death or victory? I guess let's go with this. Victory. What did we get? I won, I know. What did we get? A hundred wishes. Okay. I, I'm, I'm assuming wishes is money. Because I had four and I thought that if I go here I would get like five or six. But it seems like four is nothing? Uh, this is a crystal. Crystal means challenge. We will go to the challenge room later. Let's first power up our characters, you know. Uh, these are our enemies. Oh, I can check from before what is happening. Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, let's have the her first so she comes in. Uh, let's go. She goes first so, so, so she can come in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's it. Oh, does energy... Seems like energy retains itself through fights, so I should try to max out my energy as early as possible. Run speed by 25. Killing an enemy grants you a temporary stress effect. Increase your defense. Let's go with run speed on my melee person. So she can always be next to something. Uh, let's go for another event. I mean, it was good. Okay, we see the stars, I guess. By the way, over here I see forest one, god's intervention off. Enemies repost off, threat level two. Look inside the trades telescope. Uh, reveals the boss room's position on the map. Okay. It's right above us. Uh, well, if there's the boss room there, then we go as far away as, from it as possible. Okay. Uh, the fighter's here, so he, she can definitely... Yeah, let's, let's keep it as it is. Over here. That's going to be enough, most likely. You can shoot from here. And she's attacking the air. Okay. Nice. Seems like right now we're only getting those. Gain a privilege. Attack. I like attack. HP. Who cares? Dodge. Let's go with attack on the ranger. Uh, this is goddess statue. And this is key. Let's go for goddess statue. Although I don't even know what that is. And I get to choose. Gain a super meal at the campfire. Gain a respawn potion at the campfire. Each extender gains 100 XP. Let's go with 100 XP on both. As I see, he has 25 and she has 13. So 100 seems to be a lot. I hope. 
Oh, now it became green. It was red and now it's green. So I'm assuming green means that I can level up. Uh, goddess statue is the level up. Yeah, level up. Level her up. Consume. Yeah, green seems to mean that. Whoa, we got... Whoa, okay, five levels. Definitely a good choice. Increase level stop. Select style. I would say custom for now. We'll just balance and be done with it. What does custom look like? Okay. Oh, I have to do this with my... With my keyboard. Mm, let's go with... A smidge more HP. Oh, she also gains time. Let's go with a bit more time. Less HP then. A bit more attack, some crit. I think this is good. Let Actually, I want her to be tanky. Uh, let's go like this. It's not like I have a really true idea of what I'm doing here. Okay, continue. 25. Ah, now I see the stats. Got it. Okay, on this guy, I'm just gonna press offense. Actually, you know what? Let's even make it even more stupid. Let's go, let's go custom. And let's go time, 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 time. And attack, 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 attack. Come on, full attack. 45% full time. And I like... Okay, 7 is the least I can give. 36 and 36. I mean, I had more attack before. Yeah, let's go with this. 42 attack because of the universe and stuff and time 25. Yeah, I think that's decent. So now he got 10 more time. I don't know what this means. I guess it's 10th of a second. So from 4 seconds, he now has 5. I hope that's what it means. Uh, I mean, let's go back. And uh, what else is there? Kit and explore a tower. I guess explore tower. So that means continue playing. Let's go pick up the key. I guess this is a fight, or is it just the key? Granny, hello, lovelies. Our new ascenders coming to the tower. That's such great news. It's been too long since someone tried it for real. I used to explore the tower when I was younger, but now I only managed to get lost in it. Well, at least I'm still a pretty good blacksmith. Well, the grandma character and the blacksmith character are the same in this game. Come by my forge when you get out here. And before I forget, here's a thing I found. You might need it to progress. Might. Might need the boss key, as if we are, you know, in uh, Zelda. Off we go to the next fight. This should be a joke fight, too. I mean, all the fights are joke fights right now. Uh, yeah, let's start with the classic layout. You run over here, start attacking. Okay, that's enough. Now you go down and start shooting. Okay, environmental effects. The tower will present you with different environments, such as... This grass, which can slow you down, you can interact with the environment, causing multiple effects. For example, bombs will explode. And careful of you chose to walk on vines. They are pricky. I like how it literally stops your turn to... Oh, no. Enemies are going to attack. No, she was she's going to get attacked there. But she has dodge. Oh, she has enough dodge to stay alive forever, almost. I thought I was going to get hit. Seems like dodge is strong. Privilege. Uh, after every third attack, your partner will perform basic attack in front of them. Okay, combo attacks have a 10% chance to inflict burn. I love that. I don't know what combo means though, but uh, I will go for this. And uh, I will go for this. Because uh, the ranger attacks faster. I can go to the boss, I guess. Let's go into the challenge. Let's, let's, let's uh, leave the challenge room for last. Mm, I see a bear. 18, 18, 9, 13. Bear has 98 life. I mean, I can try my best to kill the bear, maybe. Uh, yeah, let's let's begin with this. So, she should go here. And I will go with a push at the very last moment. Go! Okay. And now, I think I will go shoot this guy down. And then run over there and try to kill him. By the way, I wanted to... No! I wanted to see how to... Yeah, you can see I can blink. As, as long as I was in the blink form, in the ethereal form, I was not taking any hits. Attack. Nothing because she has parry. I mean dodge. Let's go for some attacks and then refill our dodge real quick. Yeah, I think that was safe. Let's go over here. And at the very end, I will shoot a piercing shot. Here you go. Whoop. And she's dead. Very nice. Very nice. So you can uh, 
if you if you're fast enough and start the attack, the animation will go through even if your time or your round is over. Killing an enemy adds two seconds. That's awesome. Let's go with this uh, on the archer. I mean, I'm making him the DPS. So, shop. There's a shop. Let's go to the shop before. I will go to the shop last because I don't know if it's one time thing. Hmm. She's here, she can run up, hit that guy. He can definitely kill that and then run up. And I don't think the rest can even come close to us. Okay, let's uh, let's go. Okay, this char. Okay, this guy's dead. Oh, sh he should kill something for sure. I tried to make him a ghost, it wasn't fast enough. Now he's gonna lose life. He summoned the wolf. Okay, I'm gonna get hit here. Okay, he died from flames. Uh, I will run with this guy over here and he should attack and then do the explosion. Uh, although the explosion arrow is like a cross, so it cannot get really used. Let's go. Got him. There's one over there. Okay, you kill the bottom. That should give us some time. Okay, got some more time out of that. And our shot. Got him. We didn't even lose life yet. I lost some dodge, but that was it. You gain a privilege. Uh, attacks gain a 25% chance to stun. Awesome. Who cares about that? When resting, your adjacent partner will also recover dodge, dodge points. I'll go for this on this guy. Uh, let's go to the shop. No, the challenge is supposed to give money, so let's go to the challenge. Break all the vices. Oh, that's what the challenge is. Okay, got it. I don't know if I will be able to do it fast enough. I mean, she gets movement speed when she kills, I guess, the vase, but... Kill! Okay. Come on. Oh, come on. One. Done. What? 110 never oh, okay. Seems like it's a scaling reward. Nice. We got 117% of whatever the reward is. 35. Okay. Uh, let's go to the shop, and then I can go level up, and then I can go end the fight. What are we doing here, you ask? Oh, I might ask her, okay. Well, as you know, it can be pretty, it can be pretty easy to get lost inside the tower, but a few years ago we found a back entrance to the tower used by some tower constructors to do maintenance. As long as we don't enter a challenge room, the goddess seems to mostly ignore our presence. Okay, so we use this opportunity to set up the small mid-tier shop. <laughs> Feel free to use what we found in your ascension. But we only accept wishes in here, as the tower seems to remove any other rewards if we don't partake in the challenge as well. Uh, good old counterattack in front of you. What is this? Good old counterattack in front of you. Okay. Increase your defense stun by 4, increase your run speed by 25. Okay, then we go for this on this. Counterattack on her. And uh, movement speed on him, as she already has some. So let's make him faster too. And that would be it. I bought everything. That's, that's what happens when you get a hundred of those uh of the currency let's go back and level up real quick by the way this is red and this is green so now is the chance to see if i was right about how that works so he should not be able to level up yep and uh, she should be able to level up yep uh let's go defense i could go balance but let's go defense uh to be honest right now it's uh, really enough to uh, that I don't need to min-max, so I can just pick the default choices. Let's go fight the boss. Let's see how this goes. Boss, defeat the boss. Okay. Uh, he has a second bar here. Let's go. Let's go. The boss is filling up a bar. Oh, charged, hit. Rolling my way. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, got it. Enemies have repost gauge that fills when, with every hit they receive. Okay. Repost gauge decreases naturally with time. When the gauge is full, it will return it will turn red and trigger the enemy's repost move. When his move is to blink, uh-oh. Why did she get bugged? Uh let's think about this. There's nothing to think about. Attack. Oh, that thing attacked me. That's regen. 
Okay, let's go over here. Whoa! Oh, that's a real-time thing. Okay, let's let's heal up then. Well, that wasn't fast enough. Okay, there are real life, uh, real time skills that I have to avoid. That's fun. I mean that. That's fun. Okay, that's enough. And now let's regen. Got to regening. Uh, I will wait for this to fall down. There's literally no reason for me not to wait here. And let's go attack. Let's do an arrow shot and start regening. I triggered his ability. Uh oh. Okay, I lost two max life. It's okay. Two life is okay. Let's go here and let's do ultimate. Ultimate! Oh, I hit my ally? Didn't feel like I hit my ally. By the way, why? what is this? Uh, I think we're ending this here. Let's go. She's attacking the wrong person. The wrong side. Ultimate! It's dead. It's dead. She's attacking wherever. <laughs> So, it's literally they are attacking where they were looking. It's not that they are attacking where they want. Uh, where the enemy is. Spent wishes. Oh, I get go. Okay. Okay. Is that uns is, is there unspent XP too? Rims visited, enemies killed, and bosses killed. So, okay. I have to keep in mind that I should not waste wishes if I want to get some meta progression going. You made it through the first floor. How was it? Do not get overconfident. This was only the training area. I get it. The goddess likes to set the stage for newcomers. You, we wish you the best for what's to come. A guild distinction. You unlock the new charm in the shop. You, so you collect your first tower wishes. You found something. Otherwise, you can always come by the shop tower, spend them. You gain 50 gold. Thank you. Granny Smith rescue mission. Okay. Uh, I've opened my shop. Come see the weapons. You gained 50 gold. Complete the mission. Uh, strongest one alive. Congratulations. Completed the verify gift. You're quite impressive. Members for ages. You unlocked a new weapon in the shop. Ragnarok. Wolfbane is the completed mission. Boar Crusher. You unlocked a new weapon in the shop. Wait, that was it? Weapons in the shop. So I got Ragnarok. Sword and shield. And fishing rod. Which is a bow. Fishing rod is a bow. Very nice. So 75 gold. I have 228. So I guess that's by both. Yes. And let's equip on this guy. This one. Plus 5 damage. And more critical and more time. So there are weapons that actually affect your time. That would that's awesome if that's if that's a thing that exists. Charms, what do you sell? How much? 75. I have that. Max HP initial initial dodge and defense value. That's good. Initial privilege, partnership, dodges friendly attacks without losing dodge points. Okay, normally you don't dodge those. Let's equip it on both. I got an achievement called item hoarder. Uh, kits is closed, pets is closed. There are pets, nice. Uh, yeah, let's, this is 28 minutes. Yeah, let's do one more uh, as fast as possible. I mean, I hope this is going to be at least less than 50 minutes, but... Uh, it is what it is if it's a bit more. Uh, I have no XP. I have nothing. Let's just start exploring. Uh, I guess let's go into the XP fight first. Now nah, let's go into the item fight first. Okay, once again enemies. Let's start with the melee. I know she has like a slash for her second skill. So no, I cannot use the slash here. Let's confirm. And uh, I see the enemies. I'm pretty sure I can kill this guy. Let's actually go for this. And that's a kill. And push back. If I pushed it one more, I would be able to... Uh, charge. No, I want to do the charge shot at the end. He's, he's gonna just go through the evasion. It won't matter. I would like to know if the evasion gets actually maxed up or not. Because uh, the skill points actually stay. So maybe evasion stays too. More movement, more damage, dodge friend. I already have that. Um, increase your movement or let's or, or damage. Concentration on enemy post off. Let's go with damages on uh, him. Okay, now I can go for the XP. Actually, this is the random event, right? A yeah, random event is whatever. What's this? The map? The final map reveals the full map of the current tower floor. Very nice. So now we can have a plan. Man with a plan. Yeah, let's go down here to the events and stuff. There's a shop too. Let's go for the XP. I found the key too. Um, there are some mines here, but it's okay. 
I mean, let's go. This isn't gonna be anything hard. Come on, run. Oh, almost had him. One, two. Let's go here. One, two, three, four. Oh, skill used. I used it in time. And uh, my energy actually did not... My mana, my, my evasion or whatever did actually not refill. And 5 XP. And they are not green. They're red. They still haven't found enough to level up. Seems like the first dungeon had more XP than needed. Um, Hero might get hit. Or maybe not. And let's go. Hoop, 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 hoop. Got him. And you shoot from here to there. I don't even know how much range this guy has. Let's maybe do a charge shot. Nope. They will attack us, but I have evasion. So I'm not afraid, to be honest. Let's go again in here. That should be a win on him. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Done. Okay, and you should start shooting. Let's maybe cast. Let's get some evasion. I wanted to get evasion at the very end. I don't think he's going to do anything to us. Yep, still 11 evasion. As long as I have evasion, let's do this fully charged so I get some energy. He did not get hit from that. I just wanted to get my energy filled as much as possible. There the money. Uh, this is a challenge room, so 4 XP. This is gonna be the vase again? Okay, this is gonna be the vases again. Let's, uh... I think this character's better for this, isn't it? No, no, he's better. Shot, shot, then pierce all these. Perfect, man. I'm not sure he is actually better, but... Yeah, I think he is. Even more on that. Come on. I wanted to go there and do a slice to the bottom. It's gonna give us a lot, though. Come on, come on. Da -da 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 -da. At least 100, yeah? 36. Not even remotely close to 100. Is this not a challenge? This is a shop, and this is a challenge. Let's go to the shop. Let's see what she's selling. Uh, killing an enemy grants you temporary up. That's decent. Uh, max charge attacks get a 25 chance of filling next time. Max charge, though. And good old counter attack in front of you. Mm, how much money do I have? I have 48. Let's go for the counter attack on her. And uh, let the rest be. Let's go for the challenge again. What's this? Collect the maximum of crystals while avoiding the lightning strikes. Yeah, I mean, doesn't matter what the character is. I mean, I don't have movement speed on any character either way, so... I could go through these things. There's no reason other than time. 90%, 100%. Got it. It's okay, 120% is decent. Decent, decent, decent. Let's go. Off to the next one. Come on, 30 XP or something. I'm never falling in these numbers. Uh, let's go event. Oh, uh, gain plus attack privilege. On who? Plus eight? I guess on her. On him, on him. I meant him. Uh, there's no reason to go. Is the shop a one-time thing? Yeah, the shop's a one-time thing. I'm gonna keep the other shop for the very last moment. Uh, let's uh, level up. She has 140. Yep, she got five levels. Uh, let's go full balance on her. And on the other guy, I'm gonna go custom and go for a attack and time again. I mean, might not be a good idea. But I don't care. Here, 36, 36. 26 attack and 1.4 seconds on time. I think time is important. I mean, it's, it is obviously important as it's giving you more DPS. Let's go get the key and also whatever the event is. Oh, hello there. Come here, help me, please. I'm testing this new device in the tower. At least 22 times it exploded, but I'm sure this will work. Oh no, well, maybe it's time to go back home and do some more computation. At least I found this curious item in case that could help you. The key. This curious item that might help you. And you're like, it's a key, bro. It's it's literally a key. You, you know what it is. 
It's not a curious item. <laughs> it's a key. Uh, let's go with Mele first. She will go on over there. I mean, it says there are like z attack zones, but I don't see the attack zones. Are in seven. Uh, with the archer, I can kill the top and maybe the right. Yeah, let's let's try this. I can cut the. Whoa, they have repost. What does repost do on them? I didn't even know. Oh, repost is uh, they attempt to run at you. Okay, got it. Not an important repost. Nothing. Yep. And counterattacked. Most likely nothing. And also most likely not. <laughs> Heal 30. Oh no. And off we go, my boy. No, no, don't. He ran away. Okay, let's go here. Let's go here. And I'm gonna keep my mana up. Uh, oh, this guy's repost is an attack in front of him. I'm gonna keep my mana up and not waste it. Just because... Uh, let's dodge. Oh, his repost is where he's looking. That's good to know. That's very good to know. Yeah, I'm gonna keep my skill points up. Just because uh, I want to have them for the boss. I mean, as long as the fights are a joke. Combo. Attacks have a 10% chance to inflict burn. When resting, your adjacent partner also rests. And max charge. Go for a stun. Let's go for combo fire on him. And you know what I should actually do? I should... What is this? God statue. I oh, will go for that. But uh, before I do anything, I want to go Tarpedia. Stats effect. Burn. Deals 15 damage at the start of each turn. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, but I would... What I would really like to know though, privilege list. I would like to know what combo does. Sorry for that. It should be... You know what? Let's leave it be for now. Let's let it be. Let's just play. And um, yeah, if you know what combo does, then just comment down below. I'm gonna read it and I'm gonna know from the next fight on. Um, what is this guy? 26 damage. Okay. 109 life. So I can get rid of the wolves. Two wolves here are definitely gonna get rid of. And that guy over there. Right, let's go. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna do anything. Ah, uh, I wanted to charge it. Let's go kill that wolf over there. What? Charge shot. At least I got him. Ooh, that was a Bomberman explosion. Okay. I did not know Bomberman explosions are in this game. Let's first begin with getting my regen up. Let's maybe push him as far away as possible. Oh, he jumped in the air. Okay, let's bring her regen up so she will not get hit no matter what. He, he, I meant he. Let's go for a charge shot. 93. Man, charge shot does an insane amount of damage. Okay, got it. So that guy blinks off the map, jumps off the map, and then comes back and does an explosion and then also attacks you. Killing an enemy adds two seconds. I like this. After every third attack, your partner will perform a basic attack. Let's go for this. This is a bit dangerous, though. Regardless, let's go for this. It's a bit dangerous, but it is what it is. Dangerous because of the reposting. In a super meal at the campfire, we'll go for the 100 XP. Respawn potion. I mean, I'm full life. If anything, the XP is gonna make it so we're gonna die even harder. Uh yeah, let's 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 go get the levels. It's uh it's a bit tiresome though, the way they have done it. You have to go to the statue, press consume. She got a thousand levels, man. Uh let's go balance. Did I go defense before? Let's go balance. She has five seconds turn around. I'm gonna go custom on him again. Custom. I'm gonna go the same thing. Full on attack. Full on time. 36, 36. Now he has 6.1 seconds. I guess it's seconds. I don't know why it's not literally writing seconds if it is seconds. I guess they wanted to have stats on this. I'm gonna clear every single room as fast as possible. Uh, yeah, I mean, let's start with her. Let's go. Oh, this thing is running backwards when it's... At, I got it. Shield up. Come on, come on, Regen. Okay, I should have maybe done a one-shot on that. I bore. 
It's gonna attack us, but I have I think I have enough defense to not get hit here. Yeah, I should have enough defense to not get hit. Ah, enemies obviously don't go don't happen. Any nothing happens to them through the spikes. Okay, got it. So now I would like you to do your ultimate. That's not what I wanted you to do. I need him to shield, by the way. Let's go for mega shot. That's gonna explode in one second. Oh, it didn't hit us. Nice. First region our shielding. Then damage him. Maybe push him off the map. He jumped. Okay, regen or shielding then and run to the top. And I think we're okay here. It's not like I can do anything. Drop and attack. Obviously nothing here. And I regen up. Hit him a bit. Stop. Now she can do like a fully charged shot. Maybe one shot. Yeah, it was one shot. Very nice. Very nice. As long as I have a barrier, I don't think... I'm gonna call it a dodge barrier. As long as I have the barrier or a dodge, I don't know. As long as I have a dodge ready, I'm pretty safe. Maybe if a thousand enemies attack us, maybe not. Then we're not gonna be safe. But otherwise... Go for a slash. Okay, then this guy is obviously dead. Let's do one and another one. Got him. So now I have enough dodge, so it won't. I won't have any problems here. Oh no, 23. He's not even gonna arrive at us. Okay, that's enough, I think. And one shot. No, uh oh. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get hit. Uh, we barely got hit. Maybe we didn't even get hit. How did that guy, the first guy, how did the first guy die? Oh, from burn in the sky. Uh, after every three attack, your opponent will perform a basic attack. I can... Attacks get 25% chance to flex stun. I mean, it's max charge. Killing an enemy grants you temporary strength. You know what? Let's go with this. On here. On her. So now the archer is also gonna attack. Okay. Uh, a bear is behind us, but otherwise, I think the enemies won't even be able to move, so... I mean, look at this. Easy peasy. Let's go for an explosive shot. No! That was a huge mistake. Oh, no. Okay, we're gonna get hit here. I don't see... Yeah, I don't see a way we're not getting hit. Enemies are running into each other. Don't hit her. No. Ho, 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 ho. Uh, yeah, she can shoot down the wall. What are you doing? What? Shoot over there. No. Shield. Regen, regen. Okay, whatever she had time to do. Now she hits gonna go around. I, don't, I did not know it could go in there. Okay, can this, like, drop? Ah, it can. They have life. Got it. Okay, got him. And now you should be pretty much dead. Okay. I thought that was, that was blockable. I thought when I hit him, he could, would get stunned. I'm mixing up the, the, the two things. I'm mixing up the boar and the cat. There's, like, one enemy that actually attacks you when you attack him, and there's another one that's jumping back. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use her ultimate. Charge up. Oh, come on. She didn't get her ultimate in time. That wolf's not really gonna do anything to us. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Got it. Okay, now... Yeah, this guy did... Oh, he's ranged. Okay. Wolf, wolf's dead, and now maybe he he didn't get hit very nice. So we start with region first. First let's region, fully region, and then let's push him into each other. Nice. Now I will go with the pierce here. I will run away. Okay, I'm getting hit for sure. Oh, that was such a big mistake. Such a big mistake. It's not even funny. Yeah, it's not even funny how big of a mistake that was. <laughs> Let's go for a push. 
Okay. Okay, you can push enemies into water. Push enemies into, into water while they are in critical health. Oh, only when they're low life. Got it. Defeating them instantly. You must use a push action. They still have too much HP. They will bounce back, receiving small damage instead. Okay, got it. I think it's time to go and eat. I think we have some kind of food, right? Privilege. Dodge. After every third attack, your partner will perform a basket attack. Does that thing stack? Let's go with just damage. Let's go into the final random event. Maybe it's healing. On the scroll, read it. Gain a random privilege. Uh, I guess two seconds on kill. And uh, let's go to get our level up. And then we go to the shop. Oh, there is another fight here. And then level up and then shop. Uh, yeah, let's let's always start with a melee do woman. This thing's gonna miss. Push, 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 push. Okay, you can maybe kill that thing. Another two seconds gotten. Another two seconds gotten. No, oh, no. Okay, good thing it dropped over there. What? That thing didn't play yet? Uh oh. That guy's dead. I'm not gonna go into the spikes. Okay, you regen first. Attack over here. And do a blink. I thought blink was not wasting turns. Okay, didn't get hit. Very nice. Okay, will our dodge meter. Maybe wasn't fast enough. Will your dodge meter. Uh, maybe she will get hit instead of the other guy. Maybe he, he will get hit instead of the other guy. Okay. Will your dodge meter. That was enough. Will your dodge meter. That's enough. Is she bleeding? Is he bleed? Oh, I, I think he's bleeding. And he loses life when he moves, something like that. God's intervention, God's intervention. During the fight, the goddess may intervene by activating a random event. XP pickup, blah blah blah. If the effect targets a specific character, the icon will be displayed. Okay, what's the event? Regenerates 20%. Okay, the god's intervention is that the enemies heal. Very fair. Very fair. Okay, time to go back to base to heal. Chance to fire flame. I guess let's give her also a chance to do fire. Is this the shop? Yeah, let's go to the shop and see what there is. What there is, what is there. Combo fire, combo counterattack, stunning. Let's go with combo counterattack on this guy as she doesn't have it. Let's go with combo fire on her. And uh, I guess forget the stun. 25% to stun if you fully charge your weapon. That's what I understand. Okay, now we go for the statue first for the level up. Nice. Two levels. Let's go with balance. Level this guy up too. And uh, this time let's go with... No, actually let's continue doing the same thing. I mean, it's working, so... I guess it's working. Uh, half, mm, half a second, I guess. And uh, now, let's go for kit. That should have some healing, right? I have a respawn. Each ascendance, 25. Okay, that's not a lot. I thought it was going to be more. I thought it was going to be a full heal. Well, we go to the boss without full health. But we can just try to avoid him, you know. By the way, I think the item that says that you, you regenerate both your allies is... Evasion is really good. <laughs> Let's go in. Oh, this guy's uh, repost goes slower down. There is no reason for me to let this repost trigger. So I'm just gonna do this and wait and see. Let's hope he doesn't tag my line. Okay, he's a CC guy, got it. Let's go over here, maybe kill this. Uh oh, how many of those are there here? Uh-oh, that's not good. No, that's one shot this guy. I need to obviously get rid of everything. This guy gets his... Uh... 
I don't know what. Are we post make some damage immune? Oh, he did an explosion. Uh oh. Please don't explode here. That was not good. He's full. He's still reposting. I don't know what this still reposting means. Regen first. Run away second. Attack. Okay, let's see what he's still reposting means. Body damage. Regen first. And now we go for damage. Now I go for an ultimate. I, I, I pressed the button, by the way. To attack here. I will not press the ultimate. Let's keep the ultimate for when the enemy will actually, you know, summon monsters or something. Let's stop. Okay. Summon monsters. That's not good. Regenerate. <laughs> Gotta love that, man. Gotta love that. Got him. Shoot that guy down first. Yeah, you're not going anywhere, my dude. He's dead from flame. Regen in case of safety. Need to open this thing up here. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Yeah, this one's dead. Regen and start attacking. Wait for the repost to go down. Let's go for ultimate. And uh, now her turn. Ultimate. It's gonna trigger. Uh oh, I obviously did not want to trigger that. But how would I know? Don't I? Okay, he attack. Okay, okay. Almost one shot that guy. Let's go for damages as much as possible. Regen. Maybe I should. You know what I should have done? I should have uh, pressed taunt. I have a taunt on both characters. Okay, we will continue just attacking you as you pretty much don't have your repost or anything. The boss is dead. Let's go for AoE and another one. Get some time on this character. And bye. Easy peasy, man. You get two seconds on each kill. Easy games. Enemy spawning units. You're actually using that for your advantage. Very nice. 2F forest done. 46. Rooms visited 100 this time. Oh, we got a lot more gold. Spinny, spinny flippies. Bravo. It's been a while since I cleared the second. In our prime, my partner and I almost made it all the way to the top. Never mind, kids. Nostalgia, you know. You know. Happy to still be useful. Can I make those fine weapons when you need them? Come by my shop and take a look around. You go a longer way with a little upgrade. You gain 50 gold. Thank you. I find my shop. Blah, blah, blah. Completed bird trap. You unlock the new weapon. Okay. A hammer. I don't care. Uh, orb collector. You unlock the new charm. Very nice. Very nice. By the way, these quests. I'm going to show you where these quests are. You unlock the new weapon in the shop. Mer Mercy. Okay. I found an ice weapon. Try them all out to find the perfect fit. This is lore. Uh, Nature's Wrath. Unlock the new weapon. So we got a new bow. You, your weapon's aren't enough to knock down the enemies. Bring them some materials and I make your robust to ever seen. You unlock the new charm. From plenty of wishes. I unlocked a new kit. A new kit. Okay. So you have started to gain 75 gold. The very gifted. Gain 100 gold. Okay. Let me show you where the missions are. The missions are here. Okay. No. No. I did. Ah. Okay. Let's go escape. Let's go uh, quit. I hope quit doesn't bring us completely out. Okay, I hope. So the missions are over here. Um, tab previous. Yeah, here you go. So for example, here it is the most precise one. Reach 50 points in critical for one ascendant. And you gain whatever the reward is. And you got a bunch of missions for every single tower level. So, uh, it's important. Yeah, there is a bunch of stuff to do here. You can go around doing missions and stuff. Uh, I want to go back. I want to see if I can buy anything. So, what are the differences here? Sanctuary, when resting, your adjacent partner will also recover dodge point. Okay, that's good. Both of them will start with this. Actually, I can make it so that one starts with the one trinket and another takes the other. So, for example, the, the ranger could get this one. And the, the warrior could get the other one. Killing an enemy grants you a temporary boost. Yeah, okay, got it. Uh, there is a trinket I haven't found yet. Obviously, I also start with better base stats. So these are supposedly better. Uh, let's go weapons first. I should always, always, always buy weapons first. 
It's a bit sad that it's a bit uh, weird that you cannot see. It should here say from a granny mission on world F1, I guess. I mean, it's not that it should do it. It would be nice if it would. I have 400, 500 money. So I'm most likely going to buy the weapons. What do you sell? Uh, level up, speed plus 20. What do you mean speed plus 20? Level up, level up speed plus 20. I don't know what this means. We're buying this. It's an upgrade on speed. Whatever it is, it is. And uh, let's go over here on the weapons. Let's uh, buy the arrow first. Uh, not on her. On him. And uh, let's buy her a broaden, so broaden sword. So shield. Shield and sword. I'm not sure if I should go with shield and sword. I mean, it didn't feel like the shield gave us some defensive capabilities or whatever. But it is what it is. I don't have money for the talismans. I mean... This is good, but uh, from all the choices, I think I will first go with whatever XP speed is and uh, damage. Uh, so yeah, either way, that is going to be it. If you guys liked the video, drop a like, helping out the channel, guys. And if you would like to tell me anything, any tips, like for example, what combo does, anything you would like to tell me, uh, just comment down below. I'm reading every single comment, so um, I'm definitely gonna read yours too. And uh, I'm also replying to most of them, so I'm really active in the community overall. So that's how you could speak to me. Otherwise, you can speak on my Discord because I'm actually reading everything over there too. And uh, yeah, if you would like to support me even more, there is always Patreon for that. Uh, maybe the rewards are not that exciting, but at least you will have your name on the screen for a lot longer than you would in any other content creator, as uh, I'm leaving these names on for most of the time when I'm starting to analyze stuff or uh, think about anything. So, overall, about the game, I liked it. I will play at least two or three more runs just to get a feel of the complete um, feeling of the game, you know, not only just the first uh, two dungeons. Because maybe there are a bunch of other stuff that we have not yet seen, like pets, and maybe there is even more customization. I want to see this game through, and uh, if we even, uh, you know, finish the game and beat it, then even better. But uh, for that, we will be see. Time will tell. If you guys watch it and like it, then I will complete the game. If you don't care, then uh, maybe I drop it, maybe I don't, because sometimes I decide things on my own too. Either way, that's going to be it for today, so thanks for watching. And see you guys. Oh, oh! Before I, before I before I leave you guys, uh, I think next videos will be shorter. I don't want to have one hour videos on every single game I play. So maybe next video is gonna be like a forty minute run. I, I don't want to have a sixty minutes run on every single video I do. So yeah, just a heads up on that. Either way, that's going to be it for today. So thanks for watching, and see you guys around.